Hello and welcome to my YouTube channel Tech and Tips with King. In this video, I am going to show how you can install and run PC version Python software in your Android with using Exegit Windows Emulator application. So let's get into the video. In this video, I am going to show how you can install and run Python software in your Android with using Exegir Windows Emulator application. So basically, this is the uh, PC uh, Python software the windows version of the python software so in this video i'm going to show how you can install and run uh, the pc python software in your android basically while using this uh, process you can also install any other software so there are a lot of lot of uh, videos on my youtube channel in that videos i have shown how you can install and run any pc software in your android so basically in that videos i have shown a lot of softwares like photoshop microsoft office uh, pc browser and many many other pc softwares required by the many people so if you want to uh, know how to install any particular software so let me know in the comments i will try my best to make that video on that software so as you can see in this video i am going to show how you can install and run python software so basically python is a high level computer programming language while using uh, that software you can uh, do a lot of things so in my uh, uh, upcoming video i try to make more videos on python so a lot of people are interested in python and there are a lot of uh, scope future of the python while using python you can create a lot of softwares and you can do a lot of things while using uh, with the uh, python if you want to install and run python software in your android so first of all you need an application called exegir windows emulator application so basically this is the application for the android while using this application you can uh, install and run any pc software in your android so there are separate tutorial video on my youtube channel you can check out my youtube channel well in that video i have shown how you can install and run exegir windows pc emulator application as you can see this is the application and as you can see this is the mod version of the exegate windows emulator application and i have made a separate total video you can check out my uh, check out that video so after successfully installing the exegate windows emulator application you have to uh, download the python file python setup file as you can see this is the python 2.7.18 msi so this is the official version of the python i've downloaded and i provide the downloading in the description you can check out the download from there so as you can see after downloading the python setup file you have to keep it in the download folder of your android internal storage because exegate will going to access only the download folder of your android internal storage so you can after opening exegir windows emitter application you can access all the files so just now we're going to show you so after downloading python setup file you have to open the exegir windows emitter application so as you can see this is the exegir windows emitter application and the interface will look like this so at first you don't see anything uh, this is the previous uh, software i have installed in my android and I'm, i have made a separate video you can check out there so this is the mirc software i have installed and made a, already made a video on my youtube channel so now you have to click on these three dots you have to click on the manage containers you have to click again three dots you have to click on the run explorer at first there is no container if you check out my uh, separate video on exegir you, you will understand what i am doing over here so you have to click on these three dots you have to click on the run explorer so it will going to launch the uh, desktop of the exegir windows emulator application as you can see and it will automatically open the explorer file explorer of the exegir windows emulator application so it will be the landscape mode so let me just turn the android phone and i will set up the camera and come back again so as you can see in the screen this is the exegir windows emulator application desktop while using three fingers you can hide the status bar of the exegir like this and this is the a uh, file manager of the exegir windows emulator application as you can see this will same look like a, a pc windows pc so let me just increase the screen size and as you can see so this is the file manager so this is the d drive as i mentioned earlier uh, you have to keep the setup file in the download folder because the exegir uh, emulator application will going to open the d drive as a download folder as you can see when I click to D drive of this my computer so as you can see this is the my computer and this is the D drive when I open the D drive uh, here I can access all the files from my uh, Android internal storage from the download folder as you can see so make sure to keep uh, any file if you want to access in the exegir you have to keep in in the download folder so as you can see this is the uh, python setup file now I'm going to long press on it let me just click to open 
So as you can see it will saying welcome to python 2.7.0 select whether to install python to all users so let you have to click on the install for all users you have to click on the next and you have to here you have to click on the next so it will selecting the destination directory so you have to click it will automatically going to install in the c drive you don't need to worry about it so let me just click to next and you have to click on the yes So you have to click on the next and as you can see the install python so the software has been installing over here and it will removing all the temporary files and copying the new files so as you can see in the screen So as you can see in the screen the python software has been successfully installed in my android phone it will take in some several minutes so let me just click to finish so as you can see the software has been successfully installed so let me just minimize the file manager now you have to click on the start button same like windows you have to click on the programs and as you can see in the screen it will automatically appear on the screen python 2.7 in the programs now you have to click on the python software the so just now i've opened the software as you can see in the screen the soft python software has been successfully opened in my android phone so this is the basically pc version python uh, in android running in the android with using excel windows emulator application so as you can see finally the python software software has been successfully installed in my android phone and it's learning over here so let me just quick a uh, quick overview brief of the application so let me just click on the file so i don't know more about this software but i try my best i just now uh, have learned something about this software so let me just click on the new file and i will show you how it's going to work so let me just enable the keyboard while click, click while clicking on the screen with the two fingers you can enable the uh, keyboard for the execute windows emulator application So this is the command just now I have uh, typed uh, in the python so let me just click on the run run in the run module so before we have to run you have to save so let me just uh, save it in the d drive because it will also going to save a uh, uh, save in the android internal storage so you have to give any name I'm just give to name test just click to save so it's been saved and it will going to run so as you can see it's running so just now we have type hello world and the uh, the python is successfully wor working so the people who know about the python they will understand this so this is the very beginning and the basic uh, learning about the python this is the hello world so the software is perfectly working this is the pc version software uh, perfectly working in android with using exergate windows emulator application so as you can see in the screen this is the python software perfectly working in android so that's it for this video thanks for watching please subscribe to my channel like this video share this video if you have a question or problem let me know in the comments thank you